recognition. Laundry balls can completely eliminate the need to use laundry detergent ever again. Detergent does not clean clothes, water does. Water is the universal solvent. The reason for detergent is to ionize the water molecules and make the water wetter so it penetrates the fabric better. There is no better way to ionize anything than with permanent magnets. Two strong magnets have been coated in plastic to keep them from making noise in your washer. The water sloshes around the magnets and is ionized, and that does exactly the same thing detergent does, with the exception that the magnets do not need to be replaced and there are no phosphates or harmful chemicals flushed down the drain. Independent laboratory tests prove that laundry balls get clothes clean. Other products claiming to clean clothes have been outlawed in some states, necessitating proof that our laundry balls do get the job done. You can request a copy of these certified lab results from any UCSA dealer. There is no need for you to ever buy laundry detergent again. We also have a spot and stain remover that is totally environmentally By a uh, we manufacturer, we have these. We have the, we have a patent pending on these things. This is our product exclusively, and uh, this will replace your detergent. Now, most people have never heard of these. Get get that skeptical look on your face. They come on, you know, replace the detergent. That's hype. But basically, uh, all the detergent does is it has a whole bunch of filler in it, a whole bunch of stuff, and a very little bit of the active ingredient. The active ingredient, what it does is it lowers the surface tension of water, makes water wetter. That's all detergent does. Water is universal solvent. It's water that actually cleans your clothes, not the detergent. The detergent assists the water. And what better way to ionize water but with magnets? They work just do the same thing. Uh, Procter & Gamble knew this back in the 40s when they came up with Tide, but they realized that if you sell somebody something like this, you sell it to them once. If you sell Tide, you sell it to them on and on and on and on. So they didn't go with this. Uh, in fact, in that handout I gave you, there's some uh, tests uh, of the different of the laundry balls and how they work. The next test that we're getting done is a direct comparison test between the major uh, detergents and these. Uh, there was another system that we started out with, and it was a laundry ring. And I used to have one of those, but I've lived in all the different uh, places we moved to, like that lost the ring. <coughs> and the ring was filled with uh, liquid, and uh, they did work. But uh, the problem with those were that if you got the water real hot, the liquid would expand, and it would weep through the ring, and eventually instead of having the ring full of the liquid, it'd be half full. It was filled with a liquid that had piezoelectric salts in it. So when it was agitated, it would create an electrical field around it, and it'd do the same thing as the magnets, and it didn't work. Uh, they did a test where they'd uh, taken one of those rings, they, they, they put it in a beaker of water, and they took two different other laundry systems, detergent and something else, and put them in beakers, and left them set overnight, and then they sent me the results on them and said that those laundry rings didn't work. And so I sent it back to them, I said, your test is valid. And they said, well, what do you mean by that? I said, well, the fact of the matter is, is that that laundry ring had to be agitated. Without the agitation, you didn't create the electrical field. Without the electrical field, you didn't affect the water. I said, so your test to put it into a beaker and let it settle in $10 because you didn't have agitation. Now, if you put our laundry balls in there and didn't test on that, it would have, we don't, you don't need agitation for these. They work quite well. Uh, if you get a set of laundry balls, before you use them in your washer, uh, I need to get this included into our, uh, our information. I don't think so yet. You need to run uh, through your rinse cycle uh, four or five cups of vinegar through the rinse cycle in your washing machine. Do that twice to break up the oil. In your washing machine, soap builds up on the inside and it gets scum. Like really nasty stuff. When you start using the laundry balls, you're going to start breaking that scum up and it's going to come out in your clothes. And we had people complain that their clothes were dirtier when they first started using it. And that was because of the scum. So you got to clean out the inside of your, uh, your washer before you start using these. And you'll notice when you do start using these that for about the first week, your clothes, your washing machine water is going to be sudsy. And 
Why is that? Because right now you have detergent in your clothes that's sitting there causing your clothes to break down and uh, wear out quicker. And this is going to remove those. And then all of a sudden you're going to find that your clothes are softer, fluffier, less lint, because they're not tearing themselves apart with all these chemicals. And they're going to start lasting longer. The colors are going to stay better. And uh, you'll never have to buy laundry. We have a guy who has uh, eight kids, and they've been using this for three years. And they wore out once that laundry balls, and we had to give them a new one because these are our guarantee for life. And they've never used detergent since, and they love it. And we've, we've not had people. We've only had one person who uh, had a negative report, and that's because they had real soft water. Well, their water was so soft, they really didn't need any detergent. And they said this didn't do any better. They didn't do anything at all. And the detergent, and I said, we'll try it without your detergent. And they found out their water did it without the detergent, too, because the water is very, very soft. They didn't really even need anything. But now this only uh, works for your detergent. It will eliminate detergent. It is not a stain remover. Uh, your detergent, or most detergents aren't stain removers either. So we, we include in this a, uh, a bottle of uh, laundry stain eradicator. This is a very good stain remover. It's totally natural uh, enzymes. Uh, won't uh, hurt the environment. We don't do anything to hurt the environment. But this is a very good stain remover. This comes with it. You get when you buy a set of laundry balls, you get a, uh, when you buy a kit, you get the laundry balls, and you also get this as well. And you, they can buy this stain remover. Uh, I think by the gallon. I'm not sure. Bill, do you know? It shows a gallon. Yeah. Okay. On the price list, you can buy this <coughs> gallon from Rico. And then that's what you can sell.